back to the last video of Motoganda, at least for this year. 2017, I will continue for sure. But on this video, I would like to talk basically about how 2016 went and how 2017 will continue on this channel. So first of all, a big thank you to all of you for watching my videos and for sharing them and subscribing and so on for all the support. A big thank you. So even if I didn't reach my initial goal for 2016, which was 100 subscribers, well, currently I'm quite close to 50, so at least halfway done, which is already quite cool. But for 2017, I'm gonna set myself an even more ambitious goal, I think, and I hope you help me reaching that goal by continuously sharing the videos, liking the videos, putting comments, and so on. So my goal for 2017 will be reaching 1000 subscribers. Sounds quite a lot, I mean compared to the 50 now, but well, one should always aim high. So today I'm actually not going my usual way to work, but I wanted to show you a bit around in the, let's call it, outskirts of Malta. So content-wise, I'm a bit kind of upset with myself, since I only managed to put 15 political motor vlogs out but well I'm still pretty new to video editing and publishing and all that stuff plus I have normal daytime job as well so not too much of time but well I hope that will improve a bit in 2017 so that I can actually increase my output so let's have a look at a point which for you might be most important or at least I hope so the content what will change there in 2017 well obviously I will continue keeping my main focus on political comments in the motovlogs so basically I don't know what all will be happening politically in 2017 but pretty sure Trump will be a topic every now and then and what else is still predictable already? Well, there will be elections, general elections in Germany and France. And obviously we will see how things continue in Syria. Actually, there's already a video planned for January about that topic. So this one is coming for sure. Well, or well, let's not say for sure, of course I had already three videos which I planned and then due to political situations other stuff became more important. So obviously I will focus on the most recent stuff which happens. So let me give you some examples of what else is planned apart from the political motor vlogs to get you already a bit curious about it maybe for example in january there will be a build video of my new 
rendering and gaming PC. The second thing will actually come around February, I think. And actually just came up a couple of days ago, since unfortunately I dropped my bike as you might have seen on Instagram or Twitter already. So, since I'm gonna have to bring it to the mechanic anyway to fix it, there will be, not yet sure if just one video or a couple of videos about the fixing process. Because I thought, well, once I need to bring in the bike for service anyway, I'm gonna do some modifications. But I'm not gonna tell you yet which ones, so don't miss that video. Or videos. Depends on how long they actually will become. The third thing which is basically planned someone towards summer is not yet 100% sure if I'm gonna do it or basically just to say it as it is I'm not yet sure if I'm able to afford it of course this would be going to the UK for some stunt schooling or that might be actually something where I could try out some crowd financing. So if the channel by that time is slightly bigger, of course, I mean, let's be honest here, with 50 subscribers, crowdfunding won't be too successful, but well, maybe if I have couple of hundred subscribers by then crowdfunding might be an idea for that and last but not least content wise as I mentioned already in the last video I'm thinking about putting out a new format and going for some interviews obviously in that case not on the bike then, I mean, interviews on a bike. First of all, I would need additional equipment for that and I would need to take people for a ride, which I don't really like. I don't like passengers at all. As I said, for example, in the last video, maybe an interview with the hijackers of the uh, airplane or some alternative idea interviews or well maybe even just crosses my mind right now what might be interesting as well maybe even getting some opinion from other moto vloggers about political topics and that actually that sounds like an idea as well and I'm still working on the new logo or basically not new logo the general logo and channel design and I'm actually quite close to finishing that well actually took me ages and I'm not that design guy, so... With the new logo there will be coming as well a new intro and new outro. I'm playing already around with that a bit. So I think that all... So the new logo and layouts and everything and the new intro and outro, that all will come Still in January as well. Ah, and actually, a special thanks to the band Contrast here. Of course, they agreed that I can use uh, part of their song 
for my new intro. I will actually put a link to the full version song uh, in the description already. It actually fits so perfectly for, for this channel. And soon after the design is done, there will be obviously then some merch available like stickers and t-shirts and don't know yet what all else. Since apparently, and I was really surprised about that, apparently I got asked already about merch. I mean, a 50 subscriber channel getting asked for merch, okay. Pretty cool though, but pretty surprising. So that one will be available, I guess, February, early February or late January. We'll see. And you will even have the chance to get some of those merchandise stuff totally for free. I'm not gonna tell you yet how exactly. Of course, I'm gonna put a video about it when, yeah, basically when the merchandise arrived. But what I can tell you already, it will be kind of a competition thingy. Actually, you will be finding information about that on the website on which I'm working as well, motoganda.net. At the moment, this uh, website still just redirects to my YouTube channel, but I guess in around February as well there will be an entire website with all the links to my social media and obviously to YouTube as well and apart from that you will find there as well some smaller articles some more regular articles of course well basically recording the videos and cutting them and producing them and everything takes quite a lot of time and this year I missed quite a lot of stuff which I would have liked to cover but I just didn't have the time for it uh, so articles are being written way faster and so if you're interested in my channel not just for the motor vlogging but as well for the political opinions uh, well, it might be a good idea to already bookmark that website so you will get even more frequently and more up-to-date Thanks SD card for deciding to be full already so that the last segment has to be in the dark again and there will be actually one last thing which will change in 2017 or which will be added in 2017 in case you want to extensively support me not just by sharing the videos and liking them and commenting and so on you can of course I will set up a PayPal uh, donation link which will be obviously posted below the videos then so feel free to use that link if you want to that would be actually really amazing if you would support me in that way but if not well you still can support me whoa but still I appreciate a lot as well the usual support with sharing the videos and commenting and liking and all that stuff and it would be really amazing as well if that increases next year even more and you could even start that support already with this video 
course if you enjoyed it make sure to hit that like button and share it with all of your friends all over social media and whatsapp and wechat and i don't know what else is all out there and one thing i forgot to mention i mean i always mention to please subscribe but apart from that, if you want to make 100% sure you don't miss any upcoming videos, hit as well this bell button next to the subscribe button to enable notifications. So you will get notified each time a new video comes up, so you won't miss any for sure. That's it so far from me for this year. So I wish you all a happy new year and an amazing 2017 and I see you in the next video.